Hi, fifth graders. It's Thursday, April 30th, and I have recorded myself using some supplies that I typically have in the science classroom and that you would usually get to explore with if we were at school. And so when you continue watching this video, um, you will see me use a comb and a popsicle stick, some um, crush bottles filled with different amounts of water, and some palm pipes that are made out of PVC pipes. So I want you to watch this video um, and make some observations about the different types of sound. And after you do that, after those videos, I have put some information on about the news ELA article that I would like you to read and um, specifically then which questions I would like you to answer. So make sure you watch the video and it will tell you exactly what you need to do. And I think that is it. Um, oh, after you read the article and answer the four questions I need you to answer, then there is a study jams where, again, it's just one of those watch a four minute video, answer the questions that go with it for practice. Have a great day. I have a comb and a thick popsicle stick, and I'm just going to run the popsicle stick along the tines of the comb here. Let's do that again. You can hear a slight change when it goes from the smaller, thinner tines to the thicker tines. Now, if I go faster, you'll notice the sound changes. Okay, these are called palm pipes, like you hit them on the palm of your hand. And I've got three different sizes here. They're just made of PVC pipe. So I will start with the largest one. And that is the largest palm pipe. The medium size. Oops. And the smallest. So you'll notice depending on the length of the palm pipe, it changes the pitch of sound. These crushed bottles are filled with water and green food coloring, and the food coloring was added just so you can see the level of the liquid in each of these glass bottles. If we were together at school, you would have a chance to be um, trying this out in person, but I'm going to just demonstrate for you. Um, if you have it at home, you could always try it at home, um, but you gently have to hit the glass. We have in the past had a few glass bottles break, but okay, I'm going to start with the um, glass bottle that has the most liquid in it, and I'm going to work my way down to the bottle with the least amount of liquid in it. So you'll notice the less water, the higher the sound. I'll do it one more time. When you go to read the News ELA article, it might be titled making sound and I want you to see when I click on this article it opens it up here making sound but then it says the three things you need to make sound and that's the article so yes it's making sound and the three things you need to make sound are the same article once you open the science article about sound and once you've read it, you're gonna click where it says activities. And when I open this up, there is for ELA, write and quiz. You're not gonna do those. You're gonna come down to where it says science and you are going to choose the quiz. 
Science quiz, there are four multiple choice questions, and that is all you're going to do after you read the article.